Hey everyone, how are you doing today? Okay, so I'm here and finally Mr. Lucas decided to come down a little bit. Um, I mean, he did have a good night. He did have pretty much a good morning, but now it's like, I don't know, 11.30. And he has been a little bit cranky, like, um, I kind of fed him a little bit, but he was gassy again, so I had to, you know, give him the medicine and kind of wait for him to, for the medicine really to like take effect and stuff. And see now he's getting cranky. Let me show you, baby. Oh, and my parents and my husband they went uh, food shopping now, so it's just me and him now and the doggies and the kitty. <laughs> So yeah, he um, it took him a while to fall asleep last night though. It did take him a while um, because he he slept so many hours like right before bedtime. So then he you know he just woke up like when we all were going to bed. He woke up and he was cranky. Um, he did uh, like I said he slept a few hours together. Before that he was very very awake yesterday uh, but he took a long nap between I'm gonna say I don't know 4 and like 8 8 30 p.m. or something like that so like I said he was pretty cranky uh, I mean it took him a while to fall asleep then he was fine he, he slept fine after that but uh, yeah so yeah guys not much to tell we took him to the um, to the I mean okay of course he didn't go to see the dentist but <laughs> my husband he did have a cleaning appointment and so the girls over there we so we, we brought Lucas with us and the girls over there were oh my gosh I love that hair <laughs> they were crazy about his hair so yeah so it was really nice to uh, you know for them to meet him I I was very happy because I don't know you know like I said they knew I was pregnant and stuff like that so yeah so that was nice and i don't know what plans we have for today okay i had to kind of cut the video because they started barking who knows why <laughs> but they were kind of barking like crazy so anyways um yeah not much really going on today um like i said tomorrow super super early morning i do have to go get my blood drawn to uh check my glucose and see and make sure that you know the diabetes was just stational, like, you know, it's just gone. Like, now my hormones and everything is back to normal. So, I'm kind of, like I said, I'm getting a little bit scared. I don't know why I'm a little bit scared. I think after failing that first test, I realized that anything is possible, anything can happen, and to never be, like, take anything for granted. Don't be sure about things before you actually, you know, before they happen, like... I don't know guys, I really didn't think I wasn't going to fail that test when I took it when I was pregnant and it turned out I did and I had gestational diabetes when I was pregnant so I'm a little bit scared that you know I'm going to fail now and they're going to say you have diabetes <laughs> um, yeah that wouldn't be cool so I'm a little bit scared but like I said then after that we're going with my mom uh, to the Indian restaurant I mean for lunch so that's gonna be nice but yeah guys it's gonna be an early start tomorrow uh i'm gonna try to vlog a little bit you know before i go there and stuff and see what happens okay so all right guys i will catch up with you later bye <laughs> it's a beautiful day here guys beautiful beautiful spring day i wish the summer would be the same i wish the summer was the same you know like no humidity and you know, nice weather, warm, but not too hot. But unfortunately, summer here in Florida is hot, hot, hot. Hey everyone, okay, so today was another day that I didn't get to vlog much. I mean, like I said, apart from, you know, going to show Lucas to the girls at the office, from the, the dentist's office, we did, didn't really do anything very interesting. Um, so yeah, and I went for a walk with my mom and Lucas, but I forgot to bring my phone. Like, ha! I knew I had to bring my phone for something, and yes, that was to vlog, and I just left it. 
I realized I didn't have it when, when we were in the middle of the walk. We couldn't, we couldn't go too far anyways because Lucas got cranky. I don't know why. So we had to come back. Uh, but yeah, I, like I said, it was a pretty, pretty quiet day. Tomorrow is going to be more interesting. Well, the morning is not going to be fun at all. But, you know, like I said, then lunch with mom is going to be fun. So I'm not looking forward to getting up so early tomorrow. I got to be up at like 5. I have to be up at 5. The only good thing is I don't have to fast for this test. It's non-fasting. So, yeah, I think it's... Uh-oh, I think Lucas is crying again. I hope he... I hope he stays awake like now and so then you know he goes to sleep after say dinner time or whatever like after I have dinner so it doesn't happen like last night you know that he, it took him it took him so long to fall asleep uh, last night it was pretty bad so yeah guys but yeah I don't have much to really show you guys today uh, it was a really nice day like I said beautiful weather um, yeah just nothing much and tomorrow we'll see what tomorrow holds <laughs> but yeah I'm not looking forward to that blood test at all but gotta do what I gotta do I asked my mom I said you think if I don't go like the doctor is gonna find out and she's like yeah probably like you know she's gonna be like hmm I haven't heard from the lab for this lady here what's going on so yeah anyways okay guys so I'm gonna stop rambling and I will see you guys on another vlog and thank you so much for watching um, I hope you enjoy the video with the uh, room nursery tour that I made uh, for Lucas. Hope you enjoyed it. And I'm going to leave the link down below here on, the, on this video. And thank you so much for watching, guys. And I love you. Bye.